Hello everyone, Kyusan is here again. Today I'll show you some tricks to decorate your watercolor work using amazing features like borders and custom materials in Clip Studio Paint. Let's start! Open your work in Clip Studio Paint. My nameless blonde character needs help to complete her imagination. This time, let's try to create different hairstyles using an easy trick for making them faster and dynamic. The border effect. Go to the first character and hitting the others, click on I next to the layer. Create a folder, group and drop the layer into it. Create a new layer, go to the layer property, border effect. The border effect allows you to add a border to each stroke. Click on the edge color and change the border color from white to black. Go to thickness of edge and change the border sides similar to your line ink sides. I changed it to 1. Using the full body art as color reference, go to the tool, a dropper and select the yellow hair. Then go to the tool, G pen and start to draw your eye shape. Create a new layer, go to the layer property border effect and with the same settings as before and the same yellow color, drop some additional strands. Create a new layer, grab it and put it under the character layer. Go to the layer property, border effect. Set again the same values. With a green color, create some strands behind yellow ones, giving dynamism and depth. Once you're satisfied, create a new layer. With a black G pen, add more personality and straight to higher border.
Now I'm ready to color. Close the folder, create a new layer and click to layer below. Then set the blending mode to multiply. Go to tool, brush, watercolor, running color edge watercolor and with a darker yellow put shadows on the air. Create a new layer setting the blending mode to overlay. With the running color edge watercolor brush add some light splatters. Don't forget to clip to layer below. Then create a new layer. Go to tool G pen and with white, yellow and black colors add some sparkles, likes and details on the hair. Finished! Repeat the same process with the other two characters. Making hair has never been easier and fun. The border effect allows you to overlap different strands to give a natural flow to your character. My suggestion is to use this technique for sketches. For complete illustration it's better to ink the hair again to keep the same line style. But the result is really satisfying and it can be a great help for your work making them faster and easy. I hope this video was helpful for you showing the new amazing features with Clip Studio Paint. Don't forget to share your work and exercises with us. Thanks for watching and see you in the second part with outfit decorations. Bye!